hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel sorry guys maintain girl calm down we start before we start we're gonna kick this off with the national anthem are you guys ready hey Okay. Okay. Hey. Okay. That's it. Hey. And foremost, if you're coming back, I love you. If you're a visitor, we love visitors. And feel free to watch this video. Also, watch another video. You know what? Watch all the videos. You know, we like you. You can, you can just, just watch all the videos. <laughs> They're just two, but watch all of them. And today, you know what? It's gonna be a story time. So grab your pajamas, grab your popcorn, grab your everything. I'm just gonna tell you guys a small story. Are you guys ready? With your popcorn? Y'all are ready? It's how I, 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 my first experience in a public school. And this was like in 2010. So I do the normal procedure. I go for my interview. During my interview, I met a girl called Diana. She's not really called Diana. I just forgot her name. So I met this girl called Diana and became nice friends. You know how small kids make nice friends quickly? And she became my friend and we're like, when are you reporting? She's like, Monday. And I'm like, same. So I'm like, I'm gonna see you, you know. You know, it's gonna be us against the world, girlfriend. So when I, anyway, I, on Monday, I couldn't make it to school. I had to go buy my uniform. So I had to report on Tuesday instead. So Tuesday morning, my mom wakes us up, me and my small sister, and she's like, you guys go to school, blah, blah, blah. So she drops us. So immediately, I figure the school compound, like the compound, compound like this, compound, compound like this. Guess the first thing I see is Diana carrying a bucket of water. And I'm like, like, okay. Anyway, I didn't know what was going on. So I go say hi to her and she's crying and I'm like Like girl get your stuff together really Sasa Kwande behave yourself the hell So I'm like what's wrong? She's like she's been told to wash the toilet Bro I nearly fainted I nearly collapsed on the floor I was like you've been told to wash the what? I was like oh hell no oh hell no I'm like why? So she's like cause she came to school late I'm like, when did you come to school late? She's like, yesterday. So I'm like, mind you, I'm one day late. I'm not even, I'm not even hours late. I'm one day late. And that's Tuesday. It's not like I'd woken up earlier to, to come. The last time to do was to start at 7. But in my former school, lessons used to start at 9. So I, used to, I was like, oh, hell no. Oh, oh. So I reported my usual time, 9. So... I go to class anyway i'm like yo you sorry you bad luck so the teacher came in let me tell you my biggest nightmare was the kiswahili teacher so she came in and she's like she's giving us siji ngalia what what she's writing it on the board blah 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 everything is happening so fast so she's like i have a basi so she's give she gave us an exercise and she's like don't copy blah 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 so anyway i was like easy you know so I'm looking at the questions, I know nothing. But I'm like, she said no coping, so I'm just going to write Galia Au and Galia Zizi and Galia Nana. And I know there are no Galis like that, but it's all about honesty. You know, in my former school, like if you don't know that chair used to sit you down, tutor you, you know, things were good, you know. You know, you didn't have to pay for being dumb. So anyway. Um, I write my questions, I write all my wrong answers, and then I go and give the teacher. She almost collapsed dead on the floor. She's like, bro! So the first thing she looks at me, she's like, what school are you in? So I tell her the school I was in. So she's like, okay, basically she was just trying to tell me I'm dumb as hell in a polite way. So she's like, Aya, let her, let her, she's like, let her, the beating stick, the, let her, let her kiboko and i'm looking at her like of course the kiboko is not for me 
I'm not gonna be beaten because I'm dumb. I'm not gonna be beaten because I don't understand. Hell no, you're not gonna beat me up. So I gave her the kiboko. Hardly had I even snap put it on her face. Like yo, it was like this was the kiboko, and then I just put it like this. Hardly had I. Yo, she just took the thing, turned me around 360. Sure. Bro, Nani, have you ever been beaten from head to toe? I was beaten all the parts of my body. I was whacked like yo yo as in i don't even know what kind of violence that was i was like one who were four. Oh my god i was like you know what i need to tell god i'm sorry for all the sins because hell i'm not there's no way i'm surviving this one this one i'm going straight to death like bro everyone in the class is so amused everyone's just looking at me like i'm a tourist attraction i'm like what are me what are you doing so she bent me up she bent me up she was chunying me she was yo she was beating me up really for night Ile nice, ile proper. Na kuambia after that, I just stood up. I almost said, Asalaikum, alaikum. Shikamo marahaba. Yo. Kiswahili was like... Anyway, I'm not trying to say that it changed my Kiswahili or anything. I'm just trying to say that I was beaten nicely. And that wasn't even it. So I was beaten and she's like... She's like, okay, go see the headmaster with your book. So I'm like, fine. I mean, hell. So I'm crying. I'm crying like a baby. And I'm crying. I'm like, <gasps> so I pick up the headmaster's place and I'm like, you know what? This man has to be on my side. This is my man for days. In the interview, eh, 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 he had told me I'll be one of his top students. How can he betray me? So I pick up the, I pick up the headmaster's office and I knock and I just enter. And he's like, yeah. You know, like he doesn't recognize me. So I'm like, it's me, your friend, crying. Hello, help me. So he's like, yeah. So I'm like, um, Madam so and so has told me to come and show you my book. So that's why I'm crying like a kid. Like he's even trying, he's like, he's just looking at me like I'm a mess. He's like, so I go, I, I show him my book. He's like, come at lunchtime. So I'm like, yeah, this month. So, eh. Hey, Wait, I've not even told you guys. I said mad her. I'm like, imagine instead of teaching me, she beat me up. She's beaten me on the parts of my body. She's beaten me. I exige. I can't even walk. I can't even look. Hey, yo, I almost said I was blind. Hey, it was bad. So I, yeah, I go back to the class and I'm just looking at her like, girl, you are about to get fired. You are about to get fired. So I sit down. And then the, it's because it figures lunchtime and I go to the headmaster's office and then I'm like, yeah. So I find it with a bunch of boys, a bunch of boys, class eight. I was in class six. Let me tell you, I was in class six and those were class eight boys. So I find them, you know, I think they were like on some sort of punishment also because they were being, well, they being beaten or something like that. So the headmaster, so the headmaster, guess what he tells these boys? Oh, this is the classics who doesn't read. Can you guys sing for her the shame song? And the boys go like shame, shame, shame on you. Yo, this is not even all the nightmare. So on a Saturday, in my former school, I never used to go to. I never used to go to school on Saturday. Like I'm in class six. Exactly what am I going? Division is what they have to take me back to school on Saturday to read. So on Saturday, I never used to go to school on Saturday, and it was a thing. No one used to go to school on Saturday tuition this tuition thing so um but then in this new school it was compulsory that i got for tuition on saturday and you used to pay like i think a hundred bob like how exactly am i paying for a service i don't want and you go with home clothes so i was like you know what i'm not even gonna go so i go tell my mom that we're going to school on saturday and she even has she's like no so we we make a deal we're like just write in my diary which i later found out that the teachers don't even read those diaries guy i'm like she's just gonna write in my diary that i was i had a flu and i was like sour sounds like a deal ma so she writes um hi class teacher michelle couldn't make it to school on saturday because she had a flu and you know, like in my previous school, if the diary has said, the diary has said. If your mom said, oh my gosh, the kid can't go to swimming because she has ecclesiastics, your kid's not going to go for swimming. If your mom says the kid can't go for PE because she has genosis, your kid's not going to go. Not in this school though. 
so i'm like so me and my mom make the deal blah 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 and on monday fickers and the teacher comes straight to class and she's like the class teacher came to class and she's like how many people didn't come to school on sunday i mean on saturday and you know i'm confident as hell because even if we're gonna get into trouble it's you guys not me i am covered in the name of the diary i mean what you gonna tell me though so i so yeah so the chair is like yeah so people are so hesitant blah 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 people are even keeping their hands down i'm like me me woman me sikukuja beat me attack me i'm protected so so she's like hey you guys come in front and you guy i was uko in the new i was uko nyuma people are being beaten like cg but i'm not hearing what and you know i was the, the actually i was the only girl yeah i was the only girl so people are you know you know seeing you you know the beating is bad when you see the guys actually feeling pain you know the way guys like to kaza and they're being written like yo these guys were literally running and the woman was mad at beating people so anyway i waited for my turn if you got my turn i took out my diary i gave her she threw it 25 kilometers from where we were literally she was like <laughs> it landed in Kajiado. i'm like bro so she's like why why are you showing me the diary and i'm like because my mom wrote you something or so she's like okay so you go for the diary so i'm going for the diary even in slow motion because i'm like <laughs> anyway leo si chapui leo si chapui so she takes the diary, she reads it in like a loud and sarcastic voice. She's like, Michelle didn't come to school on Saturday because she had a flu. So the next question she asks is, how many people came to school on Saturday and had a flu? Can you believe this Judas is carried in this class? Everybody's shoo, shoo, me, 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 teacher me. I did not only have a flu, I also had chemo. I did not only, yo. I was like, bro, I give you my amigos and then you're going to do me like that though? How? How do I sit down, come my amigos for you and then you do me badly like that? I was like, bro. So anyway, I tried to explain to her. This time I'm even coughing. Eh? My coughing has even come. I'm like, <coughs> no, did I? I had a flu. She's like, girl, she shook at me and that was it for me like the many many times i was beaten in that school and i only stayed there for two weeks two weeks two weeks two i don't think you guys understand two weeks i said that for only two weeks i was beaten more than anyone i think in that school teachers different teachers used to beat me it's like they used to go agree in the staff room okay no no one got to to nachapa michelle mushai they're like me 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 okay let's form a duty rota me, 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 you, money, 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 you, Tuesday, Tuesday, you, everybody, 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 you get to beat Michelle, you get to beat Michelle, you get to beat, everybody gets to beat Michelle. Hey, yo, I was having hell time. And that, yo, to, to be in a public school, basically, you just have to have, like, tough skin. And anyway, guys, thank you for watching it this far. I love you guys so, so, so much. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Love you guys. You guys have a good week. Have a blessed week. Love each other. Make sure you guys are good to each other because it's a cruel world out here. And I can't wait to see you guys on Thursday. And I hope you guys enjoyed this so much. And I love you. And yeah, and I have a big pimple here. So if you're my enemy, you just come. We talk about it. It's not, ne it's not necessary. <sighs> I'll see you guys next time.